Hello, hello, everyone. Happy Saturday evening. This is uh, Breaking Boxes with Scotty, eBay break number two, the 2019 break. So welcome, welcome, everyone. Thank you for joining me here tonight. Uh, a couple minutes early as usual, so we're just going to kind of hang out and we'll wait for some people to join in. Had a good 2020 break. No big burrows or two us, but Definitely some nice running backs, wide receivers. Uh, A.J. Dillon pulled first Henry Ruggs. So that was cool. Pulled a printing plate out of score. That was cool. So nice little break. Looking forward to this one. Uh, another select T-Mall box. See what we can pull out of there. Those cards are in high demand. And, of course, XR has always got something good. Optic collector's boxes are fun. I always enjoy playoff. Uh, four hits. Hopefully they'll give us a good one. And then uh, mini helmets are always cool. Chris, what's going on? Sean, yeah, I, you're yeah, you're wanting a dragon scale, aren't you? Is it just Denver in this one? All right, Let's see what we can do. <laughs> We're gonna try. So, Chris, I think uh, I got to go through it all, but looks like we finally broke the. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Did we have a, anything good in the first break? What was San Francisco's? I'm trying to think, but uh, yeah, 2019, definitely, definitely. AJ, what's going on, buddy? How you doing tonight? You got the Bears tonight. All right, I like it. I like it. Ah, David finally got a team. Say, so need a Will Greer auto? Is that all? Sure, why not? I'm <laughs> oh, glad you can make it tonight, though. Glad you can make it. Hey, Sean, I'd love to pull you one. Yeah, some Montgomery. Heck yeah. I like it. Thank you guys for being here tonight. I appreciate it, man. I like the second break, too. Just uh, not worried about time at all. That first break was it just because uh, 2020, and, I mean, we had score. You know, it's got a ton of cards in it and Sage. And I was just uh, constantly watching the clock there. I was a little worried, but uh, we had no problem. But, you know, second break, uh, all right. Crack a beer, see what we can do, Chris. Ah, Chris, good. You got, uh, okay, Chris Jungberg, good. You got your San Francisco box. That Bosa is awesome. Yeah, that Kittle is beautiful, though. That's different, too. I hadn't pulled, I hadn't opened one of those. I've got a few more boxes of one. That's what I'm, for some reason, when I'm looking around, I seem to be able to, every once in a while, stumble on for a reasonable price. So I keep buying them. <laughs> They're good boxes. But yeah, that bow says beautiful. <laughs> All right, Chris Bezer says, I need some Haskins in this one. <laughs> need some Haskins tonight, he says. All right, well, let's see what we can get. Uh, plus, I just, I don't know, it's funny. I'm more comfortable with the 2019. I'm like, ah, I know these players. I know these sets. Like 2020, it's, you know, I was always second box of score I opened. And ah, practice makes perfect, right? Got to keep doing it. Yeah. We'll do a 2020 this week in Facebook. Probably a random team. I kind of like those early on. Um, you know, we just don't have a ton of sets out yet. They're all very draft heavy. So once a few more NFL sets come out, it'll be a little easier to do the pick your own teams. But kind of like the randoms. <laughs> Sean, no, I uh, I put all that aside. Uh, that'll be in the morning too. That's uh Exactly. I'm going to have a have a beer here and relax and enjoy this. So we'll do the sorting in the morning, <laughs> especially on the 2020. Yeah, that 101 Bosa was sick. Those were cool patches, man. Uh, oh, yeah, I was thinking you said that Bosa. I was thinking of the one from last night. <laughs> no, the one from last week, the 101. Yeah, that was pretty sweet. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, that 2020 takes a little work. But actually, you know what? The score for the most part is easy, though, because most of it's NFL. And I use – I have a couple of sorting trays where I, I have spots marked for each team. And, I mean, when I see that NFL logo, it's like my hands are on automatic. Just take it to the spot. Take it to the – you know what I mean? They just say a team, and my hand just moves in that direction. So the score is not too bad. It's a lot of cards, but, you know, it's uh, – the Sage are what's tough with all the rookies and undrafted guys. And All right, everybody. Thank you so much for being here tonight. I appreciate it.
Should have a good one on our hands. End it with a mini helmet. Always good. So let's go ahead and do a, a little team ownership here and get into it. So Arizona Cardinals tonight are Jacob Lampy. So welcome, Jacob. Thank you for a break with me, and uh, good luck on that spot. My hit queen stealing out the Falcons. Always good to see you, Ma. Hope we can find you something good. Got Brad Lyles on the Baltimore Ravens tonight. Good to see you again, Brad. Uh, Ryan Wandersee back for the Buffalo Bills tonight in the second break. Had a good first break, I think. A couple of good cards. I know you had a good one the other night. I was sorting one. Uh, David Spotted Eagle, like you said, snuck in there, grabbed the Carolina Panthers. So we're looking for some uh, Will Greer. Got A.J. Fairbank on the Chicago Bears, chasing David Montgomery. Uh, Craig Faulkner on the Cincinnati Bengals. So welcome, Craig, and good luck. Uh, Joe Garrell back on the uh, Cleveland Browns for the second break. So good luck, Joe. I know we didn't really find you much in the first one. Let's see if we can do any better in this one. Uh, Mark Clatterback on the Dallas Cowboys. So welcome, Mark, and good luck. Sean Metzler holding down the Denver Broncos. So uh, good luck as always, Sean. Try to find that dragon scale lock for you. Uh, Dustin Huff back tonight on the Detroit Lions. And Christopher Allen on the Green Bay Packers. So good luck, guys. Candido Manzano on the Houston Texans. Welcome, Candido. Uh, Michael Bover on the Colts tonight. I like it, Michael. So good luck. Uh, Chad Sabolsky back on the Jacksonville Jaguars. Good to see you again, Chad. George Fuller on the Chiefs tonight, so good luck, George. See if we can find you something good. Uh, Todd Butters on the Chargers, and Brad Lyles also on the Rams, so good to see you, Todd. So good luck on those spots, guys. Chris Manning getting in there on his Dolphins, and uh, Jamie Gray and Jason Shoup back on the Minnesota Vikings, so good luck, guys. Jerry Vacek on the New England Patriots. Good to see you, Jerry. Been a little while. Hey, yeah, got in there, snuck in there. Good deal on the Patriots, so good luck. Uh, Steve Piglia on the Saints. Uh, Patrick Spencer on the Giants, so good luck, guys. John Campbell on the Jets. Mike Lemma back on the Oakland Raiders. John Campbell also picked up the Philadelphia Eagles. Uh, we've got William Quick back on the Steelers tonight. Good to see you, William. Chris Jungerberg holding down the Niners, so good luck, Chris. Try to keep the uh, Niner fire going in the 2019. Uh, Michael Boger picked up the Seattle Seahawks, so good luck on that spot, Michael. John Campbell also got the Buccaneers. Mike Lemma also has the Titans. And Chris Mazur is chasing the Haskins in Washington. We couldn't find him a Chase Young in the 2020. So uh, hopefully we'll have a little bit better luck for you in the uh, 2019. All right. Thank you, everybody, so much for being here. I appreciate it. Let's, uh, let's see if we can find some fire for you. All right. Let's start with the playoff. Always like to start here. But, uh, four hits out of playoff. It's actually been... I don't know. I haven't opened playoff in the last couple of breaks. <laughs> it's one of my uh, steady go-tos, but getting harder and harder to find. So, unfortunately, 2019, I don't think the prices are going to come back down. So, unfortunately, we're winding down on 2019. I'm still searching. I got a few more boxes on order. Whenever I find things on a good price, I'll snatch it up. But uh, I think at this point, we are really starting to look forward to the 2020. But it's coming. Flash coming. Legacy coming. Valiant. Uh, all kinds of other dates. I don't know that I believe their dates on the Chronicles draft picks and stuff like that. But they've got a lot out there. Elite, Gold Standard, Luminance. At least they're advertising it and starting to take pre-orders. So I don't know that I believe their dates. But it's coming. Hmm. Oof. I'm excited, too. I started last year in the uh, beginning of August. So on that note, yeah, the year anniversary is coming up here for too long. So we're definitely going to plan something good. Uh, my wife and I were talking about that, how we're going we're gonna to celebrate that week, do a bunch of breaks or something. But anyways. <laughs> but when I started breaking last year, it was nice. It was a nice mix of sets out already. It was uh, easy to put together good mixers. So uh, we're getting towards that time frame again, so I'm looking forward to it. So we're kind of in a weird spot now, 2019, getting crazy prices, and 2020 uh, is coming out, but it's all, like I said, college and draft-heavy sets, so we need some of the uh, NFL sets. All right, there we are, everyone. Full box of playoff. Uh, 
All right, everything looks good. So uh, let's roll. Thank you everyone for being here. Good luck. See if we can find. All right, start off with a little Miles Jack, Curtis Martin, Derek Brooks, Devin Hester, Adam Thielen on a first down, 50 out of 99. So start right off with a little Vikings hit there, Jason. 50 out of 99. Come on now. Yeah. All right. I agree, Sean. Fire time. Let's get this going. All right, got a uh, stargazing here of Khalil Mack. That's funny. Yeah, it's really <laughs> been a minute since I've opened the playoff. I got to get back in the rhythm of the packs. All right, well, here's a little Nick Bosa on a rookie wave. Try to get him started. And same thing, Chris. We'll try to get him started with a little Haskins. I'm still top loading Haskins. He finished the year strong. I think their team got better. <laughs> I mean, their defense is really going to be good or has the potential to be, which should take a lot of pressure off. So I believe. All right, down to the first uh, autumn. Got, uh, Lamar Jackson, Tyree Kill, Miles Garrett, Adrian Peterson, Troy Aikman, and a stargazing of Carson Wentz. And our first auto going out to John in Tampa Bay on the Devin White. So very nice one, Devin White. I mean, he showed flashes this year already. So this guy is going to be pretty good, I think. Now, the defensive players are never quite the sought after, but uh, very nice one. So good start. Oh, first down, uh, right down there. And then it'll be numbered. So the first down to 99, second down to 49, third to 25, fourth to 10, and touchdowns are one on one. So, but yeah, that's usually what catches your eye. Sometimes it's numbering, but it's usually just the logo right down there. Oh, what am I doing? Devin White, auto go, autos go on stands. I'm not opening Sage anymore. We don't have so many we can put them aside. All right, and then a rookie card of Ryquel Armstead. I feel better, too. See, that's the other thing. When I sort the 2020, I'm going to have to penny penny sleeve a bunch of cards. And Yeah, so that one's going to take a minute. We're going to save that for tomorrow. <laughs> All right, Kenyon Drake, Marcus Mariota, Calvin Johnson. And, Michael, the other clue when you're opening is they'll be upside down. <laughs> They're not, not all the upside down cards are numbered, but usually the numbered ones will be. But not in every set. It's weird. Aaron Jones, Steve Young. It's like uh, Don Russ. A bunch of cards are upside down. Not just the autos. All right. Got a thunder and lightning there of Todd Gurley and Brandon Cooks. Yeah. Yeah, there's patterns to every set. <laughs> All right. How about an air command of Tom Brady? It's even funny. Sometimes, depending on uh, what autos you pull in, you can even predict, like, the really big hits, like the uh, Hall of Famers and the veteran hits. You pull the RPA and you know you still got a redemption coming, you got a good one. Like, you know, out of a box like XR, if you pull an RPA and you get a redemption, odds are that redemption's pretty good. Just things like that. Open enough boxes and you, <laughs> you start to learn them. A little JJR Sega Whiteside for the Eagles. And we got a Travis Kelsey. A Jarvis Landry, George Kittle, Dalvin Cook, Marshall Falk. We got a Thunder and Lightning for the Texans of Lamar Miller and DeAndre Hopkins. And then every once in a while, you think you know what's going on, and Panini says, Ha, watch this. Hold my beer. All right, got an air command of Matt Ryan. And a base rookie of Dylan Mitchell. Yep, just when you think you know what's up, Panini says, hold my beer. Watch this. I'll throw you for a loop. All right, down to a mem card. Got a Howie Long, Jadavian Clowney, Dan Marino, Deion Jones, Quentin Portis, and a stargazing of George Kittle. 
Let's see. Let's open some pennies here. We got a mem card, and it's numbered. Turning Pro. It's got a nice two-color patch in it. And it goes out to Craig and the Bengals on the Ryan Finley, number 20 out of 50. 20 out of 50 on the Ryan Finley. I opened pennies, but I knew I was going to need a thick one anyways, because, again, <laughs> Sean, you were asking about mem cards. This is exactly what I was talking about in playoff. So watch. The hundreds is tight. I'm, I mean, you really would have – I'm sure you could force it in there, but – the numbered mem cards will take a 130. So congratulations, uh, Craig. Sorry, not to change the conversation. In the last break, Sean was asking about what size uh, top loaders. I think it was Sean. If not, sorry. But I know we were talking about it. So 130 on the numbered. Now watch. We'll get a non-numbered, and it'll go in 100. Now, and I'll watch. Panini's like, eh, eh, hold my beer. <laughs> TJ Hawkinson on the base rookie for Detroit. Got an Ed Reed, a Melvin Gordon, Julio Jones. Got our second mem card coming up already. Josh Norman, Warren Sapp. Got a Damian Harris on a rookie wave. And a rookie stallions of Terry McLaurin. So rookie stallions of Terry McLaurin going out to Chris in Washington. No, nope, that one wants a thick one. Uh, you watch. Now it's good. It feels thick too. But usually the non numbered ones go into 100. Ah. <laughs> it would go, but we'll, we'll put it in 130. It's not as tight. That's funny. Like I said, you win, Panini. You win. All right. Congratulations, Chris. Little rookie stallions of Terry McLaurin for you. Panini wins round one. All right, JJR Sega Whiteside on the base rookie. So we found two mem and an auto. So we are still looking. Now let's go ahead and set these up here. Still looking for one more auto. Hopefully, uh, dress for success or something. I don't know. Are there any? I don't really see any thickies in there? Maybe towards the bottom there. There's maybe one. It could be a filler. No, not. A oh, well, that's another mem. So hmm, let's see what's going on here. Bo Jackson, Will Fuller. See, just when you think you know, we get three men. DJ Moore, Aaron Donald, not the first time out of playoff, but got a first down of Alejandro Villanueva, 45 out of 99, 45 out of 99. So that goes out to Pittsburgh and William. Congrats. Alejandro Villanueva. And then a second down of Juwan Williams, 15 out of 49. 15 out of 49 on the second down. So that goes out to Jerry in New England. There you go, Jerry. Get a hit. Get you on the board. And then a rookie wave of Paris Campbell. Yeah, I don't know what to expect now as far as autos or what. Got a thunder and lightning of Kelsey and Hill. Did you see that extra mem? But sometimes when you get the extra mem, it's because you got like a really nice, a lower numbered one, like that Finley. Who knows? <laughs> got an Odell Beckham on a stargazing. Typically, the uh, boxes with three mems have been good boxes. So fingers crossed. All right, little DK Metcalf on the rookie wave. Both that and the Beckham. But look at that. Yeah, I was going to say, I could feel that. The Beckham's got it too. Those both have. Uh, Pretty bad uh, spot on the side there. I got Justice Hill. I mean, really bad spot on the side. I thought I felt it when I put the Beckham down, and then I definitely felt it on the uh, DK, so that's why I looked. J.J. Watt, Panini will replace it if you really want. And a Von Miller, a Julio Jones, Josh Norman, a Warren Sapp, Got a Demarcus Lawrence on a Thunder and Lightning with Byron Jones for the Cowboys. A little air command of Jared Stidham. Get his chance this year. 
Okay, Rodney Anderson going out to the Bengals on the base rookie. Okay, James Conner, Sony Michelle, Aeneas Williams, Ricky Williams for the Saints. What was – I saw somebody today getting ready to line uh, – uh, Ricky Williams mini helmet, uh, hitting holes and smoking bowls was how he signed it. <laughs> hitting holes and smoking bowls. Hell yeah. Brian Westbrook. No, I didn't get in. I thought about it though. Jared Stidham, just because I was like, cool. It was an orange Dolphins helmet. It was pretty cool. It was pretty cool. Another Stidham on the rookie wave and a thunder and lightning of Cam Newton and Christian McCaffrey. It really is a shame. It's like Josh Gordon. Shame guy gets run out of the league over it. But come on. Let him play football. Who cares? Does anybody care anymore? I mean, seriously. Emmanuel Butler. I know they're going to stop testing. They need to reinstate him. It just Who cares? It is not a performance-enhancing drug. All right. Odell Beckham. Jalen Richard. Kirk Cousins. Eric Dickerson. And a third down, 20 out of 25 on the Arcega White side. So a third down for John and the Eagles on the Arcega White side. So there we go. We had first down, second down, and a third down. Yeah, replace it in a year, Sean. <laughs> All right, got a stargazing here of Andrew Luck going out to the Colts. And a David Montgomery on the rookie wave. So try to get it started, AJ. To a little one to get it started. And a Bryce Love on the base rookie for Washington and Chris. All right, now, I want to find another auto here, Panini. All right, Geno Atkins. Derek Carr. I think maybe we did. I think it's coming up. Jared Goff. Aaron Rodgers. Just in case we need to set it aside for a moment. May need Ozzy's help. But a Clayton Thorson on a first down, 61 out of 99, and that is a Dallas card. It's a Dallas card, and it's got the signed on date. Looks like a veteran card. That's why I'm hoping it's going to be something really good. Either way, I like save autos, but I could be completely wrong. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, I was completely wrong. All right. Josh Allen, I didn't see what I thought I saw. Come on, Benini. Got a thunder and lightning of Joe Mixon and A.J. Green. Better not give us three mems in one auto. Another Clayton Thorson. Oh, the other one was the first down. I was like, really? <laughs> Dang. Not, didn't see what I thought I saw. D.D. Westbrook. Robbie Anderson, Jared Goff, and then Aaron Rodgers. I just saw an insert. Dang it. Got a Debo Samuel on a rookie wave. I think we're going to get three mem and one auto. Urgh. A stargazing of J.J. Watt. In fact, I'm quite sure of it. <laughs> Still better than points. Yeah, I'll take a rookie stallions of Josh Jacobs. Take a rookie stallions of Josh Jacobs. All right, let's see. Let's try this one in the 100. Not, not one of them will go in the 100 tonight. Dang it. I'm a liar. Mem's going 130. 130s. These would fit perfectly in like the uh, 120 points. All right. And a Devin Bush on the base rookie to end it. All right. Well, I definitely like the Devin White. The Ryan Finley is cool. Like I said, I'm definitely a little disappointed that we didn't get two autos, but – I, I would rather have the uh, Josh Jacobs rookie stallions than points. So I'll at least give him that. So, yeah, Devin White, Josh Jacobs, Thorson on a first down, third down of our Sega White side, second down of Jawan Williams, first down of Villanueva. Well, Terry McLaurin on the rookie stallions, the Finley numbered to 50, 20 out of 50 on the turning pro, Adam Thielen on a first down, and a Haskins. It's not a bad start. Not a bad start. Let's do let's do the XR. Let's see if we can find some XR fire. Come on, XR. Been a while since we pulled a one on one out of you. All 
All right, just two packs, but uh, three hits. Looking for three hits. Looking for two autos and a mem. Come on, Panini, you owe us. But uh, very nice cards. Even the base cards are sharp. I'll get a numbered card. Definitely got a fatter one here. Could just be the mem, the mem and the auto, but we'll save that pack. So we'll open this guy. Get uh, sometimes on these uh, boxes only have a few cards. I like to lay them out when we get multiple hits in one pack. All right, everybody, good luck. Come on, XR fire. All right, a couple of base cards up top. I'm going to penny them all, though, because there's not very many. It's a nice set. Carry on, Johnson. I think they're good-looking cards, so. And an Eli Manning. Wrong Giants quarterback. And we'll pull uh, a rookie is a Gary Jennings Jr. for the Seahawks. And now I'm going to kind of see what we've got left here. Nice numbered. Nice numbered. Keep them all in there. Nice numbered. So, all right. All right, let's see. We'll start here. All right. How about a Julio Jones, 89 out of 99. 89 out of 99 on the Julio Jones. That goes out to Atlanta and Ma. So congrats, Ma. So you get the nice red of Julio Jones. 89 out of 99. Over here, we get a Josh Oliver for the Jags, 22 out of 199 on the nice blue. I love that Panini blue. That's, just, that's what I call it, Panini blue. It's just gorgeous color. 22 out of 199 on the Josh Oliver for Chad in Jacksonville. There you are, sir. This is cool. An X Factor number to 149. Going out to Mark and the Cowboys on the Zeke Elliott. 86 out of 149. 86 out of 149 on the Zeke Elliott X Factor. All right. So only. So this will be the only uh, member auto hit out of this box. So I'm going to assume it's an RPA, but you know what they get say about assuming. All right, going out to New England and Jerry. Wow, look at that. Damian Harris, 37 out of 49. Look at that middle swatch. That's nasty. 37 out of 49. So beautiful hit on the RPA. Going out to New England and Jerry on the Damian Harris. So congratulations, Jerry. So it's been a while, buddy. So good to see you. And congrats. That is a 130 all day. All the RPAs are 130s. And then some of the sets, they get up to 180. So, All right, so nice Damian Harris on the RPA. So we are looking for two hits out of here for an auto and a mem. Now let's see here. All right, so we'll go ahead and start off with our base here. So we've got a LaShawn McCoy. And a Mark Ingram. All right, we'll have a rookie down here. DeAndre Baker. <clears throat> going out to the Giants. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Maybe going to prison. All right, and then these should be numbered cards. So we got a Tariq Cohen, 150 out of 249. Going out to AJ and the Bears. Not the uh, Chicago running back you were chasing, but a nice card on the red, 150 out of 249. 
So nice one there, AJ. All right. And this one goes out to Dustin and Detroit, 201 out of 249 on the TJ Hawkinson. So also a red, 201 out of 249 on the Hawkinson. Those are both kind of thick here. Interesting. TJ Hawkinson, 201 out of 249. Those are both kind of thick cards. Oh, nice. All right, so we've got an XL. All right, okay, making sure I could read it. The glare was kind of funny. Wanted to make sure I could read it. All right, going out to uh, Jason and Jamie on the Irv Smith. 117 out of 149. 117 out of 149 on the Irv Smith. Come on, Irv. There we go. So congratulations. 117 out of 149. Ah, I'm like, I'm going to prove myself right. One of these is going to fit in 100. See, but it's loose in there. Really, like, I think that 120 would be perfect. When I can actually buy top loaders again, I'll, I'll get some to check them out. All right, Irv Smith. There you go, a little Minnesota hit. And this is a nice one, four out of 49. I really like these luminous endorsements. Very cool cards. Going out to John in Philadelphia, four out of 49 on the luminous endorsements. So congratulations, J.J. Arcega Whiteside, sorry, I should say his name. <laughs> Four out of 49 on the Arcega Whiteside. But that goes out to Philadelphia and John Campbell. So congrats, John. Just going straight for the 130 on that one. Straight for the 130 on that one. All right, so nice little box of XR. You got the uh, Luminous Endorsements and... A nice RPA, so we will definitely take that. All right. Let me see here. Let's do the uh... – oops, sorry. There had somebody uh, working to get in the group, so, so I just want to double-check that there real quick. All right, all right. Got that taken care of, I think. All right, all right, all right. All right, let's do uh Yeah, let's do the optic collectors. Oops. I said that like it was a huge decision, but no, we'll do the optic collectors. <laughs> These are nice little boxes though. Get uh, one auto, one mem, but we'll get uh, a couple. Hopefully, a couple of silver prisms, like three. We'll get a, a couple of other bronze prisms, which are the exclusives. Plus, the autograph should be a bronze, and then we'll get the mem card. Should be a Donruss threads, and an orange scope parallel. So, and those are pretty cool prisms. So, these are neat little boxes, definitely. All right. Let's see what we can find. Sean says, where are the Broncos at? Where are the Broncos at? Well, you said you were looking for Dragon Scales, so, you know, save all the mojo, right? Try to save all that karma and mojo. Put it towards the Dragon Scale. Excited to do the uh, Leaf Mini Helmet. I'm opening some TriStar lately. Looking forward to some Gold Rush coming back out. I think Gold Rush does the best Mini Helmets that I've seen. Just to have the specialty and everything. On that note, man, maybe time. I've got two full-size specialty helmets from Gold Rush still to open. Might be time to bust one again on Facebook or something. So definitely uh, check out the Facebook group. Got some jerseys too. 
And the busted jerseys out here, too. All right. But anyway, sorry, I'm getting distracted there thinking about uh, other things. Well, let's focus on the task at hand. All right. One optic collector's box. I said one auto, one mem is what we're looking for. And uh, plus all the various prisms. All right. We got our Donruss threads right on top. We got Demarcus Lawrence and an Eli Manning. And then going out to Patrick and the Giants on the Sterling Shepherd. I really like these mem cards, though. They're really sharp. Nice uh, big fatty. These are definitely 130s. But I just think it's a really good looking card. Got that nice optic chrome look. All right, so congrats, Patrick. We get a rated rookie of Ed Oliver for the Bills. And a Le'Veon Bell, Josh Allen. Got an elite series of Hollywood Brown for Baltimore and Brad. An elite series of Hollywood Brown. And a rookie of Julian Love for the Giants. And then a Luke Keekley and a Todd Gurley. <laughs> Sean, yeah. I don't know. It's funny how many people say that, too. And it's, yeah, when you buy them and you pay for them all, you, I, I don't know. Yeah, what's funny, though, is I, I still I love getting in breaks. I would rather, I don't know. It's weird. I, a little bit at a time. Opening the boxes is expensive, but don't get me wrong. There are days, especially when new things come out, like 2020 right now. Oh, I've been itching a few times. There we go. Our first bronze on the Brian Burns. And this one's got the wicked curve. Look at that. All right. We're going to put that in a 75 point because I don't have 55s anymore. But I don't want to force it. You transfer that into a regular top loader. It'll straighten it out. Yeah, it's hard. Believe me, there are days. But uh, I don't know, man. I love breaking. And... So that's it. You know, if I start ripping boxes myself, I can't do this. And I like getting into breaks. So Chauncey Gardner Johnson going out to the Saints. But there are definitely times when I sit here and stare at those boxes and go, hmm, I wonder what's in it. Especially what's funny is after we'll have a real hot break, I'll be like, oh man, I should open that. Hmm. I wonder what other boxes on the shelf are like that. <laughs> That's when it's really hard, is after a really, really good break. Minka Fitzpatrick, Corey Davis. There we go. First silver prism. Nice Alexander Madison for the Vikings. So congratulations, Jason. Yeah, when it, you pull a monster, that's when you want to start ripping. That's when you want to start ripping for sure. All right, and a Dakota Allen on the base rookie. That's uh, first silver prism there. Hopefully find a couple more. All right, Terrell Suggs, Aaron Jones. There we go. How about a Mark Ingram? So we get another one. Mark Ingram for Brad and Baltimore. Oh, top loader's falling over. That one's got a little curve to it, too. That's all right. Top loaders will straighten them right out. Well, Mark Ingram, very nice. Well, Chris, that's exactly why I love doing it, too, because at the end of the day, I'm not one of those – I don't buy and sell individual cards very much. All right, I definitely don't sell. <laughs> um, so I really want – I want Browns cards, and especially for them, they're usually one of the cheaper teams to pick up. So, yeah, I, I just get into breaks, man, you know, and then I can get the brownies, and I don't know. The way I look at it is, so I spend 25 30 bucks to buy the browns to find out if there's browns out of those, you know, in, instead of spending eight or 900 to open all the boxes myself, and then reselling and everything like that. I mean, I know a lot of people enjoy doing that. I'm just, I'm a hoarder. <laughs> yeah, uh, Chris, just definitely check out the Facebook group, man. We do breaks there, too, and uh, a little bit bigger breaks, like, you know, bigger boxes on the table and more of them. So, 
you should uh, definitely check out the Facebook group. Got a Gardner Minshew. It's a nice little Minshew there for Chad in Jacksonville. But yeah, that's why I was, when I got back into collecting, I was just immediately drawn to breaks. Uh, I was like, wow, okay, I can I, I can just get the Browns cards, and worst case, they don't get anything. Yeah, okay, 25 bucks. I mean, but again, as opposed to paying $200 for a hobby and, you know, who knows what you get. And yeah, I don't know. Mitchell Trubisky and a Baker Mayfield. Uh, yeah, that's why. I'd... Okay, you in the Facebook group too? Okay, I'm sorry. Getting uh, quite a crowd on the Facebook group. So thanks for joining. Sorry. <laughs> All right, how about a uh, Jordan Scarlett? In Carolina. Nice Jordan Scarlet going out to David and Carolina. So there you go. It's not the uh, Will Greer, but it is a nice Carolina hit. And Jordan Scarlet on the bronze prism. Thank you, Sean. I appreciate it. And a lot of it is I enjoy doing it. So, and I, you know, I get into breaks. So I know what I, I want to see in breaks. And I try to bring those things here and, I have a lot of fun. All right. Nice Jordan Scarlet for David. Let's see what else we got. So we found our auto on our mem, but rated rookie of uh, Noah Fant. So there you go, Sean. Still looking for our orange scope. And uh, maybe one more silver still. Got an Adam Thielen and a Drew Brees. Ah, this is a cool card. How about a little J.J. Watt? Very cool for Candido and Houston. I like those cards on the uh, vintage there or the throwback. Justin James Watt. Like I said, I definitely remember those cards. It's like the score classics and Chronicles. I definitely remember them. So congrats on that. We got a nice Tristan Hill on the base rookie. Then a Tyree Kill, Julio Jones. Ah, our orange scope, Derrick Henry. Very nice. Very nice on the Derrick Henry. <laughs> Chris, yeah, I know what you mean, man. And what's actually cool, I've got a very cool local card shop. I actually buy all my supplies there. Uh, he's got the best prices on top loaders. Better than I can get online. So I go in there and I'll watch his boxes and, uh, Every once in a while, he'll have something the right price, and I'll snatch a few up. And he's a good guy. He knows he knows I do breaks, so he helps me out a little bit. And, but uh, I definitely still – I've bought a few individuals in there. I bought a few Ozzie Newsoms. <laughs> I mean, I go in there, and they got an Ozzie Newsom out of uh, National Treasures for 25 bucks. Like, yeah, I'll take it. You know, auto. But, uh, yeah, very nice Henry. Definitely a nice Henry, Mike on the uh, orange scope there. And that is numbered 15 out of 79, 15 out of 79. So yeah, I like going into the local card shop, but I just, I don't know. I like getting in breaks. <laughs> a rated rookie on a Devin Bush. Got a T Y Hilton a Melvin Gordon. And there's another silver prism on the Ben Benagu going out to Michael and the Colts. And you meet a lot of cool people doing breaks, too, both doing them and being in them. I mean, just through chatting and stuff like that. So and definitely, if you guys are in the group and you've got things you want to sell, trade, you know, throw posts up on the page. I'll prove them. And, you know, I want the group to be able to do some of that stuff, too. If you get something cool on a break, but it's not a PC card for you, you know, throw it back up. All right, little Ben Benagu. Then a Dexter Lawrence on the base rookie for the Giants. A Richard Sherman, a Mike Evans, another bronze prism. This one is an Irv Smith. So a couple of Vikings there. Which another one, Jason. Congrats. And a Chandler Cox on the base rookie to finish it out. So that was a little too much emphasis there. Mm. <laughs> All right. All right. Another good one. And Jordan Scarlett's a nice looking card. 
So got our silver prisms, got a cool orange scope on the Derrick Henry. He said the Donruss threads are always good. Ryan Burns, Alexander Madison, that's a good little Vikings box on the silver, and then the uh, Irv Smith on the bronze. Well, Mark Ingram on the silver, J.J. Watt, Derrick Henry. I love those orange scopes. Ben Benaga, the only brown I've got. I've got a Odell Beckham one. Or maybe it's Landry. Shoot, I got to go look. <laughs> now I'm going to have to look. I know it's one of the two. All right, all right. So we've got the select team all and the helmet are all that are left. But not quite. Not quite. It's uh, got, a little, got to do a little extra. Um, really, I appreciate all you being here. I know there are a ton of breakers out there on eBay and Facebook, so I appreciate you checking me out or coming back again. Uh, I really enjoy doing this and cannot do it without you, so thank you, thank you. Uh, just always like throw a little something extra in here, find a few extra cards. Maybe should be an extra hit for somebody. So we're going to do a little contenders blaster tonight. I feel like the uh, contenders have good odds as far as the autos. We did get one last night, and it was somebody I had never heard of. So it's kind of one of those, yep, yeah, Panini said, hold my beer. Here's your auto, but you're not going to know who he is. <laughs> All right, so we get uh, 40 extra cards here, eight cards per pack. Looking for one extra hit. Watch the guy drinking during his. <laughs> Worst break, yeah. That's, I'll have a beer, but it's like I won't open a beer until I'm doing it. <laughs> like I'm not going to, yeah, that's it. I'm not going to get all... <laughs> Like tonight, I had two breaks. So, first break, nope. Nothing but water. Finally, I, well, towards the end of the break, I cracked one beer. I'm on my second beer tonight. Because, yeah, I'm not going to get all sloppy and. Nope. Nope, nope. Cards are too valuable and expensive. Plus, it's no fun. Yeah, well, I'd rather, I don't mind. I don't mind getting a little sloppy and watching some breaks that I'm in, but not while I'm doing them. It's Saturday night. Plenty of time afterwards for that. That's exactly what I'll do too. I'll finish up here and I'll head out on the porch, grab another beer on the way. I didn't get in any breaks tonight, but uh, might still watch one or two. I always enjoy that too. So, all right, everybody. Well, let's see what we can find. Good luck. Christian McCaffrey. <laughs> Pushing Star Wars stuff. <laughs> Deshaun Watson. Russell Wilson. Got a little Miko Hardman on a Rookie of the Year contenders. Yeah, it's one thing to throw it out there that, hey, I have a story, you know, check, check some stuff out. It's another to just keep hammering it. Got a John Brown, a Jordan Reed, Odell Beckham, a Luke Keekley. And a Michael Thomas, a Leonard Fournette, a Larry Fitzgerald, and a Saquon Barkley. All right, got a round numbers, but one team that is a round number two. So it goes out to the Seahawks on the Marquise Blair and the DK Metcalf. Metcalf, jeez. <laughs> I'm telling you, that score wore me out in the 2020 break. <laughs> That's the only reason I cracked a beer during that break, because I needed to wet the whistle, man. 400 cards. Whew. All right, Marlon Mack, Dante Pettis, Cortland Sutton, Kenyon Drake, Adam Thielen, and James Conner. Got a uh, Carson Wentz on an MVP contenders. And a DeAndre Hopkins, Alshon Jeffrey, Mark Ingram, Kenny Galladay, 
We got a Julian Edelman, a Duke Johnson, Bobby Wagner, Keenan Allen, a rookie of the year contenders on a Riley Ridley for the Bears. All right, Nene, where's our hit? Where's our hit? Got a Kirk Cousins, a Ben Roethlisberger, and a Drew Brees, a Chandler Jones, and an Evan Ingram. Justin, I'm not sure what you mean. Is the card broken too? All right, well, we did get an auto, but again, like last night, I got to look this guy up because I do not, even though I know, why am I looking him up? We know the team. Jeez. <laughs> You're not in 2020. I thought I was in 2020. Well, I don't know this guy in the auto, so I better look it up. All right, goes out to Baltimore on Otaro Alaka. Otaro Alaka. Oh, it's so Carson Wentz broken. I got gotcha. you. Now I got gotcha, you, sir. <laughs> yeah, have you seen the meme where it's uh, on Facebook? It's something, you know, touch Carson Wentz or something, and then it shows him falling down. It says, easy now. He's fragile or something like that. <laughs> oh, that's what's going to be interesting, though, you know, with them drafting Jalen Hurts. That's what's interesting is you got to believe the guy's going to get a chance at some point. He's going to get a chance to play. All right, so we found an extra hit, extra auto there for uh, Brad. Uh, not sure about a tarot there or however you pronounce that, but all right. Got a Kurt Warner on a legendary contenders. That kind of fits in with contenders. And a Darius Leonard. It's like I really like the contenders cards, but, you know, they push it. It's like, oh, five autos. Yeah, but three of them are. And a George Kittle, a Von Miller and a Zay Jones. Oh, uh, that's funny. Yeah, that's that's definitely why I think it'll be interesting with them drafting Hurts. All right, everybody. So a little extra there. We did get an auto. wasn't a headliner, but, hey, we'll take it. We got a few, uh, few extra inserts and rookies there, too. So thank you again for being here tonight. I appreciate everyone. All right, we're going to do the uh, select team all, and then we'll do the mini helmet to finish. So we're looking for the dragon scale here. There are five cards in here. Three of them will be the dragon scale. One premier level, one concourse level, and one field level. Concourse is the base level, but I said them out of order, but that's all right. Um, and they'll actually be stacked concourse, premier, field. We'll get two other cards. There's a chance of an auto, but they're only about one every four boxes. Um, although I got to say, I think this is box number nine that I've opened and we've only gotten one auto. So Carson hurts. Ah, ah, ah. I like it. I like it. All right. I hate these clear packs. I hope you're auto. I just hate the clear packs because I can see everything. It makes it hard for me to open it and. Try to make sure I'm not showing you guys everything. All right. So we're going to take the top card, and then we'll take the bottom card, and the dragon scales are the three in the middle. Whew. All right. Good luck, everyone. All right. Got a Mitchell Trubisky. And that is on the concourse, so that is the basic card. But it's just beautiful cards. Selects this beautiful set. All right, is it a field level? Can't tell if it's a prism or not. We'll look. It is a nice Haskins on a field level, Chris. I was hoping it was going to be autoed when I saw that was who was on the back. It is a prism. Very nice. So it is a nice field level prism of Haskins. I saw it was on the back. I was hoping it was going to be autoed, but it wasn't. So, man, we've only gotten one auto out of nine boxes. Girl. And I ordered that. Ten was supposed to be like, I, well, a case was 20, so I was hoping ten would be an inner, but they just showed up loose, so. Hopefully the uh, next one will have one. All right, nice Haskins, though. Very good-looking card. And it is the field-level prism, so for non-auto, 
That's what you want out of select. All right, everybody, here we go. Three dragon scales. These can be big money if they're the right players. Starting off on the concourse. This one goes out to Brad and the Rams on an Aaron Donald. All these will be numbered to 88. So Brad on the Aaron Donald and the Rams. You get it in here, and then we'll check out the number. He said it will be numbered 288. Nice Aaron Diver. They really are beautiful cards. I understand why people want them. They're absolutely gorgeous. I got to say, though, when we did get the one auto, I was a little disappointed because it wasn't a dragon scale. I mean, it's like a blue prism or something. It's something unique, too. But, I mean, I was really hoping it was going to be one of these. But, all right, there we go. 26 out of 88. 26 out of 88 on the Aaron Donald. So, congratulations, Brad. Dragon scale number one. All right. So I got these upside down here. All right. So number two. So this is on the uh, premier level here. Premier level. Going out to Chad and Jacksonville on the AJ Bowie. AJ Bowie. Going out to the Jacksonville Jaguars. So congratulations, Chad. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yeah, throat's getting a little dry after this. We'll make sure to drown it. <laughs> a joke. Taking my Heineken vaccine. All right. AJ Bowie, or Boye, I'm not sure exactly how you pronounce it. I've heard it both ways. 22 out of 88 on that one. So close to the jersey number. But nice hit, Chad. So you get the Concord or the uh, premier level of AJ Bowie. Yeah, just a little too early, Sean. All right. And the last one on the field level, going out to Michael in Seattle. How about a Russell Wilson? So very, very nice, Michael. Congratulations. Nice Russell Wilson, 54 out of 88 on the field level. So a nice veteran field level dragon scale on the Russell Wilson. So congratulations. Beautiful hit. Beautiful card. Yeah, I know. That's what I mean, Sean. Just, yeah, the set was a little too early. Need to get him in the other uniform, right? Need to get him in there in the, the Broncos. 2020 is coming. 2020 is coming. I, I will be getting the sets as they come out, so don't worry. All right. Beautiful Russell Wilson, though. Congratulations, Michael. 54 out of 88. And yes, I just like playing with them because they're beautiful cards. So that's why I'm sitting here just twisting it, watching it. They're just gorgeous. All right. Congratulations. All right. That means we are down to the mini helmet. So thank you, everybody, so much for being here. I appreciate it. Of course, we'll be back next weekend for more eBay on Friday and Saturday. But uh, we'll do Facebook group breaks in between. So definitely uh, keep an eye there and check it out. All right, just a quick review, though. We did a, de a nice Devin White out of playoff. We had the three men, one auto box. Got a JJR Sega White side on the Luminous Endorsements. Love those cards. Nice Damian Harris. Sick middle patch. Had the Jordan Scarlet. And the Otaro Alaka for Baltimore on our autographs. And then we're going to add one more here on the helmet. So we'll just make it room to pull that down. This is actually the first uh, Leaf one I've opened. Did a bang-up job on the uh, shrink wrap there all over the place, but there is a leaf seal there, so and it's inside on the box. But I kind of laughed when I pulled that out, like, come on, guys, shrink wrap. <laughs> all right. Yeah, I've opened TriStar. I've opened Gold Rush. This is the first leaf. But uh, the autographed helmet, you kind of got to get them when they come out because they usually sell out pretty quick or they go, go way up in price. People, I like the mini helmets. I mean, I think they're a lot of fun. Again, when you're looking at a PC and a personal display piece, the mini helmets are super cool, so 
let's I said let's check out the leaf. But uh, definitely, yeah, I've got some more. I've got some 2020 TriStar. I've got more TriStar on pre-order and just waiting for Gold Rush to hit. So, all right, there we go. Got the uh, Leaf. You said, uh, I believe these are all NFL. These are all NFL teams. That'll make it easy. But college will go to the uh, longest tenured team for retired. Or if it's an active player, they would go to their 2019 team because this is a 2019 break. So, all right, cut this seal here and do it to it. Oops, maybe. Dang, tough seal. <laughs> Into the cardboard there a little bit. That's all right. All right, there we go. All right, now I'm not exactly sure here. How it's going to look when I pop it, but uh, AJ Bouye sounds way better. There you go. All right, we're going to see pretty quick. All right, very nice. Oh, it's a speed. All right, all right. Well, I'm impressed, Leaf. It's a speed. I don't know who it is yet. Oh, get out. Look at that. Nasty. All right, Leaf. Win. Win for Leaf on number one on the Deshaun Watson. Are you kidding me on a speed? Oh, that is nasty. That goes out to Candido Manzano. Congratulations, Candido. Picking up the Texans on the cheap and getting a Deshaun Watson on a speed. That's nasty. Dude, I bet that's a couple hundred bucks. I mean, seriously. I bet those are a couple hundred bucks, man. That's awesome. Wow. Big hit. All right, Leaf. Win. Win on number one. I made fun of your shrink wrap, but never mind. <laughs> yeah, that is beautiful. I mean, shoot. That's one of those. I'd be happy with that thing. So I'm not a Texans fan, but I like Deshaun Watson. All right. Congratulations. Ah, <laughs> Chris, we finally broke the streak. You're right. I tell you what, though, that was a nice run, man. That was a really nice run. Wow, I'm wound up now. That was a nice finish to the break. Deshaun Watson, that's nasty. All right, congratulations, Candido. First break with me. Pick yourself up a Deshaun Watson Speed Mini Helmet. Right on the front. Silver ink, nasty. All right, all right. Well, thank you, thank you, everyone. Uh, Chris, I appreciate that. Keep trying. Sean, yeah, it, yeah, you're right. It was not good. Either break. Either break. But we'll break the streak. We'll get it. So uh, thank you, everyone, so much for being here. So we'll be back on eBay next weekend, Friday and Saturday. But we'll do some Facebook breaks in between. Definitely do some mini helmets because I'm wound up after that now. <laughs> but, uh, again, thank you, everybody. Enjoy the rest of your night. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. And I uh, hope to see everybody soon.